is a beautiful and complex nation. The Japanese adhere to ancient customs and yet remain at the forefront of modern technology. With an unparalleled work ethic, the Japanese are engaged in business throughout the world. 95% are Buddhist or Shinto, with less than 1% Christian. Yet cultural and religious differences have not stopped the Christchurch Choir from developing deep and meaningful relationships with the people of Japan. On the week that the tsunami hit Japan, a friend of ours was in Nashville, a pastor from Kyoto. And when we heard about the tsunami at Christchurch, we knew we had to respond. We were able to go to Japan and see firsthand the devastation in the Tohoku region. Miles and miles and miles of absolute devastation. It gave us an opportunity to share kindness, to share redemption. We were able to do several concerts to raise money for the victims of the, of the tsunami with the people that we saw that had lost absolutely everything. Just a couple days after we got back to Nashville, we lost one of our members that went on the trip. Thankfully, we were able to capture footage of, of Maurice on that trip, and it really captured the essence of our church's heart for Japan. We are all created in God's image, and we are called to serve each other. Gospel music is a message of hope. It draws all people of all nations. There are so many cultural differences between the U.S. and Japan, but one thing we definitely have in common is that we love gospel music. Fill us with the light of day, Lord, fill us. Fill us. Oh, we need you, yes, we do. Fill us. Fill us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fill us. Fill us, fill us, fill us, fill us. The gospel that comes from the U.S as a music is very interesting to Japanese people and it is very good. I believe the gospel is a healing medicine for the people's heart who needs to solve problems and issues in life. In 1992, the Sister Act, the movie, had, was a great hit in Japan. The person who appeared on the screen, their lives would drastically change. So Japanese people understand that gospel music has the power to give them energy. decided to be intentional here in Japan about not only doing concerts, but about building relationships among the people here. And one of the most powerful ways we've seen to do that is to sing songs in Japanese. <laughs> We've been spending a lot of time doing workshops and training sessions with universities and many of the local church choirs around Japan. One of the most powerful things I have learned through the Japanese culture is the importance of intentionality. I'm so struck by even the architecture of every building. It's so intentionally placed. And the Japanese are also very intentional in their relationships. Going to Japan and singing gospel music has given us an opportunity to share kindness, to share the love of Christ with these folks who don't necessarily understand um, what they're singing, but as we get to meet them and have conversations with them one-on-one, -on -one, we get to explain what this music is all about. It's really an incredible privilege to be able to represent Nashville to Japan. Our hope is that the Christchurch Choir can be a bridge between Nashville and Japan. We're confident that this is a great door of opportunity for the future. <laughs>